Okay, welcome to my how to cut and wash cut and prep tomatoes to make sauce, homemade sauce. So what I have here is the tomatoes all washed and you can see I put X's on all the bottom. I'll show you on these. You just take the knife and put like an X on the bottom. I'll show you again this one. You don't have to go too deep. Just put an X, and then that way when you go to peel them, they peel back. So then you just take all the tomatoes, come down here, and you want to put them in your pot. It's just a hot pot of boiling water for maybe two minutes until the peel starts coming off. tomatoes so then what you do I have a couple ready here to show you how easy they are to peel you just pull the skins back like that if you can see that on the camera okay and it's not hard you just kind of peel it back these probably weren't in long enough because I was in a rush trying to make the video to show you how to do it you know <laughs> It's not like on television when they have this stuff all prepped up for you. But you just pull it back. Get that off there. And then what you do is just cut up your tomato. Cut them up into big chunks. And I just put them right here in a bowl. Get them all ready to go in a pot to cook to make homemade sauce. And on my camera, I don't have a pause button to pause and then go to start making the sauce. So I have to actually turn it off. So I have to make another uh, video to actually show you how to do the sauce. But So you just cut them up in big chunks. And you can either crush them. Um, with a potato masher or they kind of just break up as they cook so I never really crush them kind of just push them down with a spoon a little bit while they're in the pot but I'll take you down to show you how these are cooking in the pot here and like I said you just put them in boiling water about two minutes and the peels start to come off pretty simple and then after you get done peeling them all let's see and then you have you're gonna have a ton of juice in there so I what I do is I usually take some of the juice and I'll put them in little containers like this they have these great little freezer containers and you can just make some tomato juice put it in the freezer it's great to have a nice tomato juice in the morning and uh, I leave the seeds in and everything. Some people strain it or cut out all the seeds. I leave all the seeds in. It works good for me. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going to show you another video on how to actually make the sauce next. But I got to get some of this prep work done. And once I get that all done and finished up, we'll go on to how to make the sauce and get a little bit of my secret recipe for making homemade sauce. Okay, thanks for joining me, and I hope you try it. It's pretty easy. Thanks for watching.